Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can also write letters to customers, vendors, and employees using the data in Sage 50. To write letters in Sage 50, select Tasks, Write Letters from the menu bar. Then select either Customer Letters, Employee Letters, or Vendor Letters from the side menu of choices that appears to select the letter's recipients. In the Select a Report or Form window that appears, the Forms tab is displayed and either the Customer Labels and Letters, Employee Labels and Letters, or Vendor Labels and Letters choices selected within the Form Types list, depending on your menu bar selection. You can also click one of these choices in the Form Types list to switch between the letters that appear in the Forms list below it. To select a specific letter from the selected group, click the letter choice within the Forms list. The preview of the letter appears at the right side of the dialog box. If the letter you selected is one you can edit within Sage 50, then you will see buttons for Preview and Print and Customize under the preview. If it is a letter you can only edit in Microsoft Word, you will instead see a Send Letter and Edit Letter Template button appear under the preview. To edit a selected letter, click either the Customize or Edit Letter Template buttons. If you click the Customize button, the letter opens for editing as a form in Sage 50. If you click the Edit Letter Template button, then click the Edit button in the dialog box that opens to then open the template for editing in Microsoft Word. Make your editing changes in Word or Sage 50. You can add data fields in Word by using the drop-down buttons that appear within the Add-ins tab in the ribbon. To add data fields in Sage 50, you can click the Add button in the toolbar at the side of the form in Sage 50 and then select Data from Sage 50 to then choose the type of data to add. After making changes in either program, save your changes and then close the editing window. To print or email a selected letter, click either the Preview and Print or the Send Letter button for the selected letter. Then select To Whom to Send the Letter within the dialog box that appears. The options change based on the specific letter selected. Then click either the Word or Email button in the dialog box to merge the letter to Word or to your default email program, or click the Print slash Email button to print or email the letter from Sage 50. After writing your letters, you can close the Select a Report or Form window by clicking the Close button in the Windows toolbar. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.